So I'm going to start with a double jab on the high line. I'm going to shift that and I'm going to throw across the body. My knee legs to step to the side a little bit and I throw across the body. And okay, so I'm taking my head off the line. I'm going to come back with the fute ba. Then I'm going to shift the fute on the midline. Then I'm going to side step out. And your choice whether you want to go low, middle, or high. Okay, whatever your capabilities are. So double jab, cross, you can the low line. You pick your target, see his elbows right there. So I'm actually going to try to come under his elbow right there. And then his open on the midline. So I'll go right there. All right, so he comes in double jab, the catch, the parry across, takes the low line fute, comes to the midline fute, and then sidestep out to the whatever line he wants. Well, fute. <laughs> that's okay. He was in the, his range was right for the chasse. We're going to be right for the fute. The idea is that once I get over here, my fute can come right into his thigh. I can with the toe. You see that with the toe right into those muscles? Oh, that's painful. I can also come right between his guard into the solar plexus, sorry. <laughs> or into the teeth and nose, if you have the flexibility. So if you're going to go high, let your partner know. Okay. The doctor goes double jab, bam, bam, across the body, fute ba, fute medium. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> We're going to try this one more time. No side step to the last kick. Double jab cross. Double jab cross. Fute ba. Fute medium. Side step. Fute on the. Yeah. Right? Nothing wrong with what he was doing. It could all, it does could all work. And we were just trying this. So slowly, double jab. Cross to the body. Fute to the leg. Switch legs. Fute on the midline. Side step. Fute on your choice of one. And then right ready to fight. Then he's got Justin. Then it's his turn. Double jab. Cross the body. Fute ba. I'm taking that. I'm not taking any other kicks. Okay? Don't take any of the rest of the kicks. Just take the first low line one for rank. We good? Any questions? Jocko apparently is having trouble understanding what this drill is. <laughs> Hopefully these guys can correct them. All right, let's give it a go. So, Oh, yeah, you're right. right, right. Okay, I need some. Here you go. Now no, the other leg. Like, oh, the other leg goes inside. Side step. No side step. Yes. So from the cross. Yeah. 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 And then makes the range from the midline. And then side step. Yeah. Okay, so let's look at the idea of maybe not letting him get away with the whole combination. So he's going to do the double jab. When he goes to the cross the body, I'm going to forearm block, and then I'm going to scoop it, and I'm going to hit him in the head with the back comes up. Right, so this is a shot just that I was going to This is a shot in Sedak called the swing, where I actually use the back of the knuckles. It's like a reverse back fist. Right, so back fist does not actually allow the fox fences, but you could do this one. I don't know. <laughs> and like I said, I think it's because in kickboxing that happens so often they were trying to make it look different from kickboxing. So they took the back fist out. There's a lot of stuff that Bob Boxman says where they wanted to make it a distinctive sport. So they took certain things out because either they thought it looked less physically appealing or it looked too much like another system, another sport. All right, so a double jab, I catch, I forearm parry, and then I scoop it and I go right into the swing. I follow with the cross, and I'm going to take on, I'm going to sidestep now. I'm going to find my range through a chassis. Your chassis is any line you want. So right now I can see which thing we're standing, right? So right now I can maybe get his midline. So he's a little bit open. I could certainly come kick his leg here. Or if I step far enough, I could kick this leg. Or if I had the flexibility, when I step out, I could certainly kick to the head. Okay? So one more time. You catch the jab. You forearm block the cross and you scoop and go right to the face. Right to the face, you say find your distance and find your kick. Joshua gets to go, he catches, he forearm blocks and scoops. So scoop it, right? Scoop my hand. Yeah, that's it. And then follow up with your cross. Kute, sidestep and find your chasse. Oh, yeah. Check what I did. Yeah, so I took the cross and the and find my line. You give that a try? Yeah? Alright. Take it slow. Walk it through so, three or four times. Let's speed up. Can you go in? 
So go yeah, like that. And yeah. Yes. 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 So this 